welcome back to time travel with tanks uh, we're on the road um, if you watch yesterday's video you'll see this video and you'll think they were just shot back to back and you would be right you would be 100 percent right uh, we just gassed up the Miata Dave and I just finished discussing the appropriate shifting RPM uh, for when we're just casually going on to a 250 mile an hour or drive um, yeah on that it's nice out it's a little windy this morning but it's Nebraska and I think that's par for the course we managed to drive 1120 some miles yesterday 1127 miles that's the most I've ever driven in a day or I've ever been in a car in a day previous record was when coming back at Christmas time in Jason's old Pontiac Grand Am and then jumping into Danny's uh, uh, Forerunner going from Indianapolis all the way to Rapid City in one day that was only 1,050 miles so new record um, just thinking about it last night when we left when we left Trinidad we had an 8 hour drive ahead of us because we are like oh this is too soon to stop we can't stop now so we, we just kept going and uh, it was kind of incredible that we didn't think like oh that's another 500 miles away from here so I guess it is what it is but we made it and now today's going to be fairly short it's 4 hours to Sioux Falls and we'll be there by noon and easy I think hopefully and then I should be home sometime in the middle of the afternoon. So, um, yeah. I guess uh, that's it for now. All right, bye. So we're just maybe 10 miles further down the road here, but Dave and I were noticing something. Agriculture was the obvious only thing you could make money with yesterday. Because there was nothing else there. But in this area, comparatively, this part of Nebraska, you could have a pretty decent logging operation. Even the towns we drove through yesterday didn't have any trees in them. So, you know, it's just something to think about that could have a pretty nice, uh, could have a pretty nice little Case setup here. Point. Cedar Valley Lumber Company. Oh, look Company. at this. Cedar Valley Lumber Company. You think we're kidding around. But we did not make a loop and come back to show you that. Uh, that actually happened. So, I mean, I think we're on to something here, Dave. I think so. So, right now, whatever town we're in, is this Marvin or something like that? Uh, agriculture number one and then logging industry is number two has to be there's no way it could be anything else another observation is that it seems like our entire route could have been summarized by follow the railroad yeah, because nice. all the way across Kansas across most of Colorado and now into Nebraska outside of when we were on the interstate we've just literally followed a railroad the whole way so you know it's the kind of things you start to notice after you've been on the road for however long it's been. I did play On the Road Again by Willie Nelson, but for copyright reasons, I'm not going to play it right here. Uh, but I played it for Davey, and and it seemed to brighten his spirits. Yes, it did. Yes. Always enjoyed Mr. Nelson's music. Yes. Crazy, I'm
which is changed. If you look out there, you can see the green tinge. Those two little ticks up, and that's what you're heading. Mm -hmm. 